Hey everyone, welcome back to Metro Last Light Redux on PS4. Ho, 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 ho. All right, so in the last video, me and Pavel, we were making our way across the surface where we were getting a bit of a bit, we got into a bit of a fight with some mutants, and we've now made ourselves towards the um, the theater. We're inside the theater now. It's a heavily populated um, metro station, so let's jump into this. Hopefully, we got some more help. Okay, come on in. Sorry about that. Dangerous times, right? We're going up soon. Are there many watchmen around? We were lucky to get here. Okay, there's a nest in the building by the wrecked plane. Man, I wonder why such a bad thing today. Oh, you want a nightmare? Well, it's waiting for you up there. No sense going with just three men. <laughs> to clear a nest, we need a couple squads at least. Oh, thank you. You're so kind, sir. Okay, so we're... Okay. If it's culture you want, the Bolshoi is up there above us. All the actors who survived are here. Oh, people come from all over the metro to see the shows they put on. Uh, this happens all the time. So this is a theater. It looks like... It doesn't look like one. It's a station connected to the theater. What's the plan? So, that's our plan. What's our plan? The station next to this one is Revolution Square. One of ours. Red. And revolution is spitting distance to police. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through, and you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Yes. Are you the one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in, then. So, my Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here. Huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Welcome, and have a good rest. Thank you. So um, they're letting us free roam a little bit here, where we can kind of inspect around the station and possibly find some vendors where we can purchase some ammo or upgrade our weapons. So let's see what we've got here. We've got pigs. We don't we don't need pigs. Um. Okay. This aims for the man shunned by the brave new world. What? So, young men, I see you like my witty sign. There is a place for everyone in this underground. Murderers, whores, tyrants, money changers, even peasants, for Christ's sake. All are welcome here. Even lousy actors. Hmm. I live in a theater where we breathe the miasma of the decaying Bolshoi. Okay. Enough. I give that guy some coin there. Some, um... Bullet. Can we speak to this guy? Hey, hey, turn around. You have a customer. Your meat's burning. Okay, nothing to do here. Let's move on. What the hell is this? Do they still do shows here? Maybe these days still do shows for entertainment. Even though, like, the world's turned to shit. Gotcha. So. It's crazy, right? This game, you walk through how much life there is in the station. There's people having conversations, you can actually walk in in the conversation and still hear the conversation behind you. Like this guy. We all hit the ground and shot at the demon until it fled. Like that guy's telling his girlfriend or wife, whatever, a story about fighting demons. This guy's entertaining kids. It's so alive, it's, I like it, it's really good. Uncle Misha, this is a demon? Well, it's... alright. This guy's telling kids horror stories. Oh, there we go, there's, there's the books right here. Metro 2035, 2033, and 2034. I didn't know that with those were the names of the books. Why is it called Last Light then? Okay, so we've got a market here. Here we can purchase all we need to um, kill the mutants. This guy doesn't want to speak to us. This guy's got ammo. Let's see what he's got. Let's see. Let's speak to him. So, ammo or secondary? We have got two hand grenades. We've got no incendiaries. We don't really need to... How much can you sell them for? One? Yeah, you gain one for selling that. It's not worth it. So, this is only ammo. This is no weapons. So, let's get some assault rifle ammo. It's only cost 10. We've got 256, guys. Because you can't see it. Because my webcam is going to be in the way. But, these only cost... Oh, they cost 60, no? Do you get 60 or they cost 60? That's how many I've got. They cost 10. So, that's, that's definitely worth investing in. So we, we've maxed out on assault rifles. 
We also max out on shotgun as well. Because that's what we're using. That's good. So we got a lot of stopping power now. There's some weapons there. I'm stuck on a plant. Um Hello? Yes. So I don't feel the need to um get a different weapon. The ones I've got are pretty effective. I've got a good assault rifle and a good silence shotgun pistol. That's what I call it, a shotgun pistol. Because it shoots shotgun shells. Uh, so are we going to watch the show? Should we queue up? Can we queue up? Nope. I want to see what the show is. So let's go through this. Okay, so Pavel said to us that we can explore. Oh, there he is. Well, Artyom, I made all the arrangements. We can go to the revolution now. They will let us in through the theater. Okay. Who's this guy? Hey, you! Stop! Show me your tickets! Why be so mean? <laughs> sure. Come in. Well, Stanislavski, you can watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room. Can I watch the show? Where's the show? Oh, the show isn't here, isn't it? Of course. Maestro, if you'd be so kind. The can can. The can can. They're gonna come out. Yeah, here we go. This is what we, this is what we came to see. That one on the left, she's out of sync. Look at her, she's way out of sync. There's a tits on the one on the right, bouncing around. They're all bouncing. Holy shit! Let's get closer. <laughs> okay, I kind of got lost there. Sorry, guys. Okay, I think we've seen all the show's got to offer. Let's um, let's go. Artyom! No? Enjoy the show? Sorry, man. Time to move on. You patron of the art. Oh, they've gone. What's next? Wait there. Let's go. Oh, here's all the girls. I'm totally in love with you girls, but I've been busy with work. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I'll come back soon. I promise. Yeah, please, do you Google. Jana, let me use your powder. In your dreams, you have your own. She was in her face. Who's safe? Got a key? Nope. Artyom? Artyom? Looks like you're a bit woman hungry, huh? Well, yes, yes, it's a hard life without a soft woman, I know. Anyways, I tell you, we should be going, but uh, let's drink to the fact we are still alive, huh? It's on me, okay? If you say so. Let's take a seat. What is that food? Looks like dirt. Opa, that's great. So, let's drink, Artyom. Yeah. That's empty. Smooth stuff, huh? And this is a good place, but uh, home is the best, you know? You know, I've traveled all over the metro and people talk all kinds of shit about the red line. That it's awful there, and there's no food, that we shoot comrades for nothing, and you can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom! Wow! So... <clears throat> Yes, our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but we have order. And everything is shared. Food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true. But no beggars either. Another drink. And now, to equality. Come on, Artyom. No, 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 no. Pay that now. We're not even filling the drink up, though. It's the same cup. Ah, uh, where was I? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, look look at the far stations. They freaking eat each other, sell their kids as slaves, it's like the stone age. Death to his own devices, a man becomes a beast, you know? War there, war there is all that matters. That's that's our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order. Blin. 
I think my guy's getting a bit drunk now. He's all over the place like that, like wobbling. Oh shit, who are these guys? They look dangerous. That's how it goes. Don't be mad at him. Just doing my job to protect the red line. And you, Musketeer, are from the wrong side of the barricade. Private, take this comrade in. The fuck? Yes, Major, sir. Yes, sir. He tricked me? Fuck this. We saved his life and he's turning us in? It is private. What a fucking dirtbag. That was so stupid of me. I bought that talk of friendship. The stupid musketeer saying, Just you wait, and we'll get even. I wonder though, why did Pavel go through the trouble of trapping me? Go through the trouble of trapping me. Hey, stop that, bleh! Prick. It's just being over enthusiastic, you know? Artyom, look, I think of you as my friend, really. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now, you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, Tavarish. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. The Secretary General? Yep. What about Comrade Korbin? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Opa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, that's you. You're a smart guy, so we understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need you. information. So, my advice to you, my friend? Cooperate. Okay? But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us, Artyom. This guy's a bit of a cock now. He's completely changed. Who's this guy? One eye. Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbut. This stranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence. He's Nitsky. You're one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found D6 together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Artyom. I think we both have something to offer. Take the... Comrade to the negotiation room. Uh, he said take me, don't fuck me up. <laughs> what <a> dick. <laughs> Young man, let's dispense with the people doctor and probing and cut the chase. Hmm? This telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark One, is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. <laughs> but, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers, one for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Gorbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lunium must start learning how to improve his uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were... Yeah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! Is that meant to scare me? Intimidate me? What the fuck? That oh. what the fuck! Still nothing, huh? <laughs> okay, bitch! You talk, or I'll fry your balls in pig fat! Passwords! Code names! 
Operation Protocol. What are you doing, Dad? What are you doing, Dad? <laughs> Daddy, no. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No. You little shit. There's no power without blood. There is. Your brother ruled peacefully, <laughs> and they still love him. Get back here! You're a thug. God damn it! Butcher. All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers. Just get everything out of him and shoot the bastard. And then come to my office. We must talk. Come back here! You may be my oh, I must agree with Leonid. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection and you will tell us everything. You inject me in the balls. Okay. Oh yeah, what happened to her, Anna? She was with us when we got caught by the Nazis initially, wasn't she? Who's this? This me as a kid? Seems like I'm looking into the past. What are they doing? Whoa. Shit. Is this our team as a kid and he's getting protected by the dark ones? Ooh. Wow. So that's my first contact with the dark ones. So they do look like they do want to save me. To go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the dark one? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. I don't think the Dark Ones are going to be as friendly. Fuck now, though. Fuck my father. And Marozov. And the revolution and my own future. I'd rather be shot and end up like father. Killing his own brother. Listen, if you get out of here, just, well, just live. Here, get in there. This is the way to freedom. Believe me, I know. <laughs> I okay. spent all my childhood. Well, good luck to you. So I'm escaping now. The general's son has decided to help me. She's pretty fucking cool. <laughs> that was my only chance of surviving right there. I wonder why he was left alone with with me. Like that's strange. So sit down, Corbett. Let's talk. About the negotiations in police? Ah. So you already know. I am the head of intelligence after all. Then why did you let the information in? Let's get out of here. Frontal assault is hopeless. But if we go underground to the church, advance through the hmm, okay. then attack from the rear. Looks like we've escaped. It's pretty good. Now I am in a real spider infested catacombs. Where the general secretary Moskvin does not look like the head spider. That title clearly belongs to General Corbett. I sure would like to know what's on his mind. What did Lesnitsky bring him from D6? What's going to destroy the enemies of the revolution? Only questions and no answers. The only thing that is clear, Pavel has information on the Dark One, which makes him my current target. Okay. So I think, did we tell Pavel the information that we don't want him to know? And now we need to take him out because he knows too much and... What is RTM's like plan now? Does RTM wanna save the Dark One? I think he might, you know. He's no longer against trying to kill it now. So um, that's all we've got time for, guys. We've just uh, finished this chapter, and the next one's gonna be us escaping from more bullshit. <laughs> so thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video. Bye.